In an endeavor to alleviate the scourge of underage drinking in the Eastern Cape, Eastern Cape Liquor Board is rolling out an ambassador program targeting schools around the province. This comes after there had been two incidents in the Eastern Cape where young people had died as a result of an adult entertainment establishment. I'm here to give hope, I'm here to give testimony that to the new ambassador that has been chosen, um, there's a brighter light in Eastern Cape Liquor Board and they can come and shine with us as the ambassador that has been chosen before and they can come join us to bring hope to others. As children, we, we grow up in, uh, under our parents' roof. They are telling the same thing. And now when each and every, when it, each and every time it repeats itself, parents speak to children, but it's better when a young blood, a youth, speak to another youth because you, you connect with that person and that person will take all his or her attention will be on you and that person I know that they will change because you are speaking directly to them and they are the same age as you. The program seeks to create an environment where LEN ambassadors educate other learners on the dangers of underage drinking. This will ensure that adolescents receive information from their peers rather than adults and can engage freely with each other. We looked at the areas that within the Eastern Cape, the mostly densely populated areas, um, because in your mostly densely populated areas with a very high population like Kabecha, you would find quite a number of uh, liquor outlets and liquor traders. So we would, we, if you if you see the the spread within the province, it would it would actually run on the same lines. Uh, you, you go the other ones in Or Tambo, the other ones in Alfred Nzo, Umzimvu only, and uh, I think the last area is uh, um, a, a Buffalo City Municipal Team dance. And so th you, just from there you can see that the, all of those are areas that are uh, densely uh, of very high population. Um, so it is it is expected that in those areas that you'll we'll find a number when you find a lot of liquor traders you'll find the consumption of alcohol as well is is very high so we've chosen those areas on those basis and uh, I, I must say that um, um, already we can see that um, this is one program that is a, a huge reception um, uh, from 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 the young and from parents as well a total of 12 schools will form part of launch and each school has nominated four learners, two boys and two girls to become ambassadors of the Eastern Cape Liquor Board Messengers on Underage Drinking. I think it is very important because in primary schools they too nazo zikuyo elendo yo yenga kyo chwala so bendi no mla wendo bama bana nazo in primary schools zibe kandi zi haifuma na le nyo ba yendo bama bana babe kandi baya baya ngenelela kolu pulo le le underage drinking baka lelwe baka kiselwe baka wazo ngena nabu babe kandi baya kwazo kutuka na nchwala the MEC has urged parents, community members, police and liquor traders to work together to fight underage drinking and the selling of alcohol to minors. From Bumagaba TV News, I am Jessica Bobo.